Welcome back to the show. Hi so guys. today we're going to talk about the, the delivery apps. So basically, um, if you're out here doing DoorDash, Uber Eats, etc., I would like to point out to the YouTube subscribers and mm -hmm. people who's watching us that you guys feel the way we feel, you know, the pain and suffering that it's like, it's not fair when we out here wasting our time driving and we try to make money. And then customers like to be petty and leave like a $2 tip. Who leaves a $2 tip? Like, or 50 cents. Or 50 cents. You know, we have people who are out there working hard. And I know DoorDash and Uber Eats and all this stuff is like... And they don't pay. Not a... It's like a hustle, but it's not a real job. But it's still... Like, if you are shopping for somebody for like $20 and they have like 15 items and then they don't leave you no tip or maybe $5 and they live about... 15 minutes. 15, 20 minutes. Right. Maybe 25 minutes. Shame on y'all. That's not right. And Uber Eats, DoorDash, <laughs> look at our YouTube. Because we're coming for you. And a lot of people actually have got notified. Um, because of the way they have been mistreating us. Delivery drivers. Who are out here just trying to make a living for ourselves. And of course, if you look at Instacart, you know, you guys have got sued multiple times. And DoorDash, <laughs> you have got sued multiple times too. And, you know, okay. that's why um, people feel the way they feel because you guys are really petty and you guys need to get us up there and promote it and check that and check mark and verify it. so we can go out there and support us and make sure that they pay us more money because, like I said, it could be people who just real jobs and that's all they do is door to edge. And, for example, we have a busy one that you guys can see right there. It's very busy. But that doesn't mean anything because when you select Dash, it can give you a $5 order. Who knows what they're going to do. But this no or $2.50 order, you know? So And don't get us wrong, okay? We understand that there are some petty-ass drivers who pick up orders and then they'll like eat the food or they'll do something that makes it bad for the rest of us. But for the people who actually work their ass off, go in, get the orders, do what they're supposed to do, deliver, and they don't get any tips or they get a dollar tip, two dollar tips, that's ridiculous. You got, they should at least, if, you, if someone is going to deliver for you, imagine. If you went to a restaurant, let's use a restaurant for example. You went to a restaurant, you know, the waiter the waiter did everything, did everything for you and you left in $2. You wouldn't do that to a waiter. So it's the same thing with drivers. Now if they're a good driver and they for example, go above sorry, and beyond, off. Yeah. Example. This is not a bad tip. Right, that's the same. Eleven dollars. 25 cents, China City. So your tip is probably you know, $5, maybe $6. Right. I'm sorry, guys. I was just trying to treat you. But anyway, um, back to what I was saying, because I was so really interrupted by you, babe. And I was trying to make a point that, you know, people just need to realize that it's just like in the restaurant industry. If you ask someone to go somewhere for you, they go in, pick it up, and then they bring it, drive it all the way to you, drop it off like you want. At least you can do is give them like more than five dollars. That's or three dollars and twenty five cents, or more even than five two. That's what yeah, I'm because we need more money. I'm you saying add five, like no less right. than oh, five. Yeah. That's true. Because it's like ridiculous. You wouldn't leave a restaurant wait a waitress that you wouldn't leave them two dollars. I've never seen anyone leave two dollars for a waitress. And then also customers. And they don't even drive. If you're out here doing placing an order on the apps, Uber Eats or DoorDash, I'm gonna use those because those are like really it's a popular. Order and they can't and it's like an eighty dollar, ninety dollar order, and then you guys um cancel it. Like literally when I mean cancel is like we go pick it up and shop. shop and do whatever we need to do. So we get a checkout and hit the key order uh, for the checkout. 
or to cancel. Like what for what? No, you need to. People like to play to around with these right. apps, and people need to be investigated on these apps because they like to play around. Either the kids like to play around, or the adults are just drunk and high, and that's the problem. You do what you do, but don't play around with our money because we lack money. Right, and it's for you to play actually and trying. To, it's really just people out here trying to make extra money, and I feel like it's not funny. Like, I get there are some bad apples who take advantage and be trying to get free food and stuff. Those are bad apples. But the majority of the drivers are actually trying to make a living, trying to work, trying to do what they have to do. And I just feel like people wouldn't want people coming to their job and messing with their money and messing with them. So I just advise you all to be nice to our drivers because they really are going above and beyond in the snow, in the rain, in the freezing rain, in all types of weather to bring you an order that you don't want to pick up. So it's it's not mandatory. It's they're choosing to do that. And then especially if it's in an apartment where you have apartment and you got all these groceries someone orders and you're bringing them up three, four flights of stairs and then they leave you a $2 tip. That is so unacceptable and wrong and people need to be called out for that so that's kind of our rant guys <laughs> so we definitely want to thank you for tuning mm -hmm. in um for this episode and give us a shout out let us know what other videos you guys want to see we do have a thanks video for coming. um the main fans that we do actually have because i yes. want to shout out to the main fans i don't know you guys name i apologize but we actually have like like a couple about consistent. like 20, 25 fans actually that's consistently watching our videos, and commenting, you, and, and we appreciate, we appreciate you, you. So I'm sorry if I don't know your name, but you know, keep subscribing, like, commenting, and share it to your friends and family. Hit the notification button because we will be doing better than before. Trust me. You know, so it's a new year, of course, and it's not over yet. So keep smiling and keep watching us. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Bye for now.